Well, it only lasted 32 seconds, but for all those who turned out to watch it, the total solar eclipse more than lived up to expectations. Thousands of people gathered in the outback town of Seduna to see Australia's first full eclipse in decades. It looked like they were going to be disappointed by cloud cover. But right at the last moment, the skies cleared for a perfect view as day became night. For some, it was a long night. For thousands of others, it was an early rise for the journey home. It was all worth it, you know, especially during that totality, just being able to look at it is just something I'll never forget. This was what they came to see. Over two hours, the moon's journey between the sun and the earth created a magical path. While low cloud cover threatened to blur the big moment, just minutes before totality, the skies opened to clear conditions. Oh, yeah. The way that the, um, the sun was covered up and we saw the beautiful blue, gentle blue shade and the, and the little bits of light around the edges, it was just fantastic and it was great being in Sedona to see it. We clocked up 3,000 k's as we drove into town, so uh, we've had a great trip over and uh, that was fantastic. Further north and still in the moon's shadow is the Flinders Ranges town of Lyndhurst. Spectators there weren't disappointed, celebrating with a dance party. Despite some initial weather concerns, astronomers rated this eclipse one of the best. It had, it had the Bailey's beads, it had the prominences, we got the beautiful diamond ring effect. We, we really saw every element that, that exists in an eclipse and, and that was uh, a real bonus. While crowds were well below the original estimates, the thousands leaving here are satisfied they got what they came for. Many are now planning their trip for the next total solar eclipse. Uh, oh, it gives me a real buzz and I'd, uh, I'd go to see them anywhere. Yeah, love to, yeah. Don't know if it'll be Antarctica though. That's the next one, 2003. Sojuna gets another chance. The next total eclipse here is in 2030. Sarah Clark, ABC News, Sojuna.